Greetings from Tromerville. I'm Lloyd Kaufman, legendary filmmaker about whom you have never heard. And I'm here today to talk to you about a little film called Tromeo and Juliet, which, by the way, was the debut film for James Gunn, who uh, went on to write, uh, after Tromeo and Juliet, a movie propounding uh, uh, um, incest. Uh, James Gunn's next career move was to write the delightful children's movie, Scooby-Doo. And I'm here to uh, take part in Trailers from Hell. Parting is such sweet sorrow. It totally sucks. I went to a trauma retrospective in England, and whilst there, I visited the birthplace of William Shakespeare. And whilst there, William Shakespeare's spirit entered my body. I cannot tell you from which orifice Shakespeare's spirit exited my body, but the result was Tromeo and Juliet. One of the reasons I like Shakespeare is that trauma in its 35 years has been, uh, I guess uh, you would call it a shit disturber, and Shakespeare definitely stirred the shit. I took a shot at writing a draft, it sucked. John G. Avelson, uh, with whom I worked on Rocky, uh, told me get away from Shakespeare and find some young kid who's in high school and, and get him to uh, talk the talk. That didn't work. One day, James Gunn walks in the office and uh, he was coming in basically to do filing or be my bitch boy. And he wrote an amazing draft of Tromeo and Juliet. Uh, it was about six hours long and it had about six urination scenes. But uh, we came up with a good, uh, very good script, dark, funny, and I think Tromeo and Juliet probably is, uh, is one of Troma's uh, most successful movies. I think it saved Shakespeare's career. And a, a little known fact that um, nobody would, uh, once again, as uh, with all Troma movies, no cinema would play Tromeo and Juliet, uh, rightfully so. Uh, and, but in this case, it was because Shakespeare doesn't make money. Shakespeare is a failure. You can't make money with Shakespeare, it's ridiculous. Luckily, Baz Luhrmann's movie, which had started two years later, came out and uh, was a huge hit, and that opened the doors for Tromeo and Juliet. There were a few uh, angry theater owners who thought that Tromeo and Juliet was uh, Baz Luhrmann's uh, movie, so that we did get a little ill will there. But uh, the end result was that Tromeo and Juliet was uh, beautifully received, very good uh, film festival record, and actually uh, has been one of Troma's finest hours.